guys. Hi. How are you? Hi. Make mistakes, I make regrets, say Get a hair while you break your neck, I get a piece of mind when I squeeze the lime, man Ready to come once you're sober up Tell them all your rings and a pen around my chuck Send ten things in the pen that I want I can find you and no end to the one Hi guys, I am coming to you from my living room floor Um, I know I've kind of been like a little MIA with everything that's going on Um, I was trying to focus on starting my business yes i started a business venture um i am now the proud owner of my cosmetic line and then i have a clothing line coming in in the works but i'm not really gonna get too much into that but uh excuse my cat gary i don't know why he's like crying and whining right now it's just kind of like so while i've been gone i've kind of been dealing with business stuff i've been dealing with anxiety depression and this is kind of like <laughs> it's, it was driving me crazy and I understand that like when you're going through a period of time and there's stuff that's changing in your life it's going to get bad before it's gonna get worse and I just had to keep telling myself that and tell myself to keep pushing and I realized that I was going through a new chapter a new phase in my life and I just had to be open to um, reciprocate it or open be open to receive it but nice. so uh, yeah so I started my business I got a new cat I got a little baby kitten he's over there somewhere you might see him like roam through the camera so don't be surprised on that um and then i freaking got 24 dollars worth of inventory for my cosmetic line from amazon okay overall i saved up about six thousand dollars to put into my makeup line so this is 24 25 dollars worth of inventory um i have stuff coming from makingcosmetics.com i have stuff coming from tkb trading but we already know tkb trading is on, on lockdown right now and they're not as they're not shipping as much stuff as they should so we're waiting on that that over there in total i have i spent about like i don't know a thousand dollars worth of this stuff for other cosmetic stuff and then i still haven't got my lip gloss tubes and my liquid lipstick tubes so we're waiting on that so i think i spent about yeah, I spent damn, damn near close to six thousand dollars, if not a little bit short. And of course, I, I put money aside to do marketing for it. So we gotta get to that. But just like a quick disclaimer, um, I know the world is going through a really tough time right now, and I know people are losing their jobs, have lost their jobs, they aren't able to feed their family, not able to feed themselves, right? And you know everyone is going through a hard time and i want to let you know that i understand and i feel for you i completely understand just because i've spent money on amazon or my cosmetic line and everything does not mean that i don't know what it's like to i don't know what it's like to not have money because trust and believe this is all of the stuff that i'm buying for my company has been a long time coming with this and it's crazy to look at now that I'm starting a business and investing six thousand dollars into a business like freaking 2019 I got fired from two corporate jobs I was making forty two thousand dollars a year and I lost all of them I had to go back to working for security and basically got a pay cut to 24 if not twenty two thousand dollars a year and basically had to live off of that and uh, every time I got fired I was out of work for two to three months and that took us all and even before I got those co corporate jobs I wasn't in a job I was basically doing door-to-door -door food delivery for a favor for Uber Eats for DoorDash and trust and believe I've had times where I've come home I don't have nothing to eat I would go spend a whole 16 24 hours on the road and have nothing to eat at all so don't ever think for a second I don't understand what you're going through because I do understand and just as it says in the Bible, this too shall pass, okay? So just keep the faith, keep pushing, keep um, living, and absolutely take this time that we have right now to not only spend time with yourself, spend time with your family, but spend time trying to figure out what you actually want to do right now with your life. If you're in a job that you don't want to be in, hey, go make a plan on what you can do to change that situation or start a side hustle, start a business. You have all the time in the world. We're spending all the time in the world at home. Figure it out. And also, thank you to all the people who are on the front lines dealing with this. I know you guys have sacrificed a lot of time, energy, and time with your family to protect us. And I honestly, truly appreciate it. But let's get into this unboxing. I want to start with doors. I didn't even bring a knife to unbox. Oh my gosh. I got... Where's my box? Oh, 
open her. You know, you're trying to look for stuff and you can't find anything? Like, that's me. I had a box opener the other day and I don't know. I don't know what I did with it. Oh my god. Oh. I'm so freaking slow. I literally put it in the drawer and I forgot. I forgot. Like, oh my god. Oh my god. Let's get into it. Also, don't mind. That thing in the corner is my treadmill. So, uh. Yeah. <laughs> oh god. Okay. This right here. Is this. Also, don't look at my address. I will blur this. Don't try to find me. Don't try to stalk me, sir. sirs and ma'am. We don't need any more stalkers. And, oh my god, also another thing that's happening. Please tell me why all my ex-boyfriends from my past have been coming back to haunt me. Like, I'm freaking Ebenezer Screws, and this is what... What is it? Ebenezer Screws? What is the name of that movie? If you know the name of that movie, comment below. <laughs> Jesus. I'm like, I'm like a little kid, a little kid on Christmas, and honestly, I couldn't, I was a little impatient with some of these, and I kind of opened it, just a little bit, just a little bit, but it's like Christmas for me, I don't really have, like, sad story, but I don't really have Christmas like that, so my family buys, like, clothes and give gift cards, I can't really remember the last time I had a Christmas that I was excited about with a tree, and with all my family there, I'm just like, ah, like, no, ooh, these are nice. So, I'm going to be doing lip scrubs also, so this is what it looks like, if you could see it, if you could see it, but um, this is so nice, so nice, it's so big, so I hate when people be selling you lip scrubs and they have these like teeny tiny bottles, and I'm just like, what are you supposed to do with that, this is definitely like, I'm definitely trying to give you like Jeffree Star lip scrub bottles with this, it's so freaking thick, thick must, you know, and then I love the chrome finish, I love it! So how many of these did I order? 30. They're already 30. I'm probably gonna need to order more, but we're gonna have to like start small and like also don't mind this. I have Hey! Gary. <laughs> I've been like working on like lipstick squads and all that, so yeah. Don't worry about that, but this is so nice. I love this. I cannot wait to get started on this. Um my cosmetic line is going to be hundred percent vegan, cruelty free. Uh is it paraben? Paraben, paraben, free. Yes, so everything. Oh, that's all. Oh, gonna, gonna, gonna. Oh, what is this? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, I got 60. They sent me two. Well, thank you. The ring's so nice. Oh. Butterfly effect. I got a little butterfly glitter. I definitely love this. Um, I got more fine glitter. So yeah, this is definitely like common handy. Handy. Box. Gone. <laughs> um, I got some bubble mailers. I definitely needed some bubble mailers, but then I had to think about it. Like, am I gonna do like first class priority shipping, mailing? I don't know. I just wanted to have like my own custom like bubble mailers. So yeah. And the name of my cosmetic line, if I didn't say it at the beginning of the video is crimson red beauty so don't try to steal it ma'am sir it's been trademarked it's been copyright it is an llc i have the domain name i have the social media so don't try it anyways this is the red uh bubble mailers i kind of like when i came up the name i really wanted to do crimson beauty but there's another cosmetic line that's like aj crimson i just i didn't want to copy off of anybody else's stuff like i want to do my own stuff and i don't really want anybody to come at me with any of that so, I mean, I could have still did it, but I was just like, you know what, I'm going to do Crimson Red Beauty. Oh yeah, these are the bubble mailers. I love it. It's not, it's shiny, it's glossy. It just gives you like that like rich, luxurious, uh, dominatrix, just like dark feel. And I kind of wanted um, my line to have kind of like a dark, kind of like sexy vibe to it. I'm, I guess I'm kind of like dark in a way. <laughs> um, I'm kind of dark in a way, but like my favorite color... I don't really have a favorite color. I have like five favorite colors, which are like pink, black, gray, white. So yeah, like, but my top, I love pink, but I also love black. So I didn't want to do like a girly gum pop vibe. I definitely wanted to do kind of like a grown adult and sexy vibe. So great. Um, let's talk about this. Amazon. Amazon. I love Amazon. Trust me. Believe. Trust and believe. I love Amazon. Um, Amazon has its moments where it's really good and then Amazon has its moments where it's not really good. And basically, um, Amazon, I asked for, 
already started opening already, but I asked for of these different ones um, because I'm going to be doing lip glosses, liquid lipsticks. Um, I also want to do like uh, face oils or face serums. I kind of have my own little like um, my rose, rose gold thing. So I got these boxes just in case I'm going to order like small things to, um, how do you, and that's another thing. It doesn't come with any instructions. Like you automatically assume, assume and think that people know how to like place these together. Like I guess it's common sense, but is it really common sense though? Um, I think I kind in these and probably like put it in another box or like take this put it in like a bubble mailer or something can it fit can it hold no okay so <laughs> um yeah i just want to make sure if i'm selling anybody anything or sending anything out to them it's protected because i don't want to hear any like it's broke and it's this it's that um because i don't want to receive any broken stuff so uh But yeah, Amazon sent me this with no instructions, but I have, I got these from a different company. These are black. I love these. And these come with instructions. It's like, you compare this, how this is wrapped to this, how, how this is wrapped. Like, Amazon, this is unusual. Anyways, let's see if I can, oops. guys, we just, I just, mm. <laughs> I just got one of the boxes. Don't use a box cutter open a bag full of boxes how about that it's like come on jimmy you, you know this you don't know this don't do that stupid um let's see what else okay so these are nice these are nice these are so glossy glossy i think it i've never put together a box before but i think if you put together a box before like you know exactly what to do Oh my god. These are so cute. I don't, I don't know. Maybe it's just me. I did it again right there. But, um, what's up with these shittings? Oh. Oh, that's why it's not going through. You can't. You can't! These are so cute. These are so cute. And then I can put my logo on it. Oh my god. These are so cute. And they feel so good. They feel so good. Oh. And then a shipping label just like slap it on there. And like I could put like stuff. I, I'm getting a cricket. That's the one thing that I didn't get. Crickets are expensive. But like I've seen some of the um, other community beauty entrepreneurs, they had the cricket. So I was just like, I guess I need the cricket too. Because I don't, to be honest with you, like I understand like you can get labels for cheap from Avery.com or like Vistaprint or whatever. But like I kind of hate seeing when you put a label on something, you, you see that film and the lines of it. I kind of want everything to just be like seamless, lightless, and just like absolute perfection and I think I can get that with the Cricut and I can just put like my website on here on both sides I can put my sticker I can tape it and then put my sticker on here I probably just have like a sticker of a rose or something like that and then put my shipping label on top of it but this is really good um I do not I'm probably gonna get bigger ones because I'm gonna have eyeshadow palettes and maybe <laughs> I'm still dealing with the eyeshadow palette thing right now um depending on what type of palette to get but the palette that I'm looking at right now um it's a little bit too big for this so i'm probably going to get bigger ones but i definitely love i love these i love these and i ordered some boxes from the u.s the united states postal service for priority mail and all that so we have that oh, this is so cute i love this wow have you ever like worn a bra and like it's starting to like stick out the bra like 
like, no, don't get me wrong. Like, I don't wear cheap bras, but, like, sometimes you have bras that are coming out and you're just like, stop. Just please stop. Oh, whoa. Whoa. Up. Okay. I think I opened one. Yeah. So these are my, uh, syringes? Yeah, syringes. These are the 60... 60 milliliter syringes and these are cute and I've seen a lot of people have these but then I watched a video that was uh, this girl was talking about um, how like these are cute and everything but when you're doing like big batches um, when you're doing like wholesale orders I don't know if I'm gonna be doing wholesale orders for my lip glosses I don't know but when you're doing that you're gonna need bigger ones than this and I was like yeah you're right you just want to make sure everything's like efficient and don't want to take in time because I tend to get a little frustrated when I have to do stuff over and over. But I got about, maybe I got about like 10. I got 10, maybe seven. I'll say seven. Um, also another key tip, key tip of the day. Uh, when you're starting a business, I would recommend that you do research on this. So I basically wanted to start my cosmetic line from 2019, back when I was still uh, corporate jobs and I wanted to do it like the good way, the real way, like the Kylie Jenner, the Jeffree Star way. And I wanted to get a manufacturer and these manufacturers were like, throw you all over the place like a damn ball and they won't take you seriously unless you have a name to back you up or you can put down, drop down $20,000 right then and there. Like there's some small indie manufacturers that they can work with, but they don't really customize your formulas and if they do customize your formulas they're going to tell you like oh it's going to charge more and then like i don't want to like i didn't want to go to like a private label and have somebody make this stuff for me and then just stick my labels on it i wanted to do it myself i wanted to know that every ingredient that's put into my lip glosses my liquid lipsticks my lips rubs my face oils right i have personally tried it i'm the one who measured it i know exactly what is in my products right before I send it to anyone. I don't want anyone complaining about it. I don't want anyone to work out from it. Like, I just want everyone to love it, like it as much as I love it, like it. Like, you already see my skin right now. My skin is like, I have freckles, but then I have dark spots. So like, where is that coming from? I have, like, right up here, like, my forehead is oily, but then my nose is, like, dry, and then my chin area is dry, and then I, like, have, like, uh, pigmentation, dark pigmentation, I have hyperpigmentation, and, like, you know, we as women, we have hair on our face, it's just, it's a lot. It's, personally, it's a lot to deal with, so... I want to make a product that can help with that and if it can work for my skin it can work for your skin because my skin is super duper sensitive and just all over the place and i i can't be dealing with my skin all the time just on my skin it was like you're gonna take what you can get out of me be lazy i don't to be honest i don't even know what this looks like this looks like this looks huge open oh, guys like follow me on Instagram or watch my previous videos I would always complain about how uh, my laptop just takes forever and a day to edit my videos and I ended up getting a monitor I basically ended up getting a desktop I got a monitor and then I got a hard drive so I'm gonna show you the monitor later and we get up and talk about all the other stuff I unpacked but I got a monitor and a keyboard <laughs> I got a keyboard um it comes with a mouse in it this is nice I mean might switch out the keyboard or something flat but this it came with the package and I really really do love it so it's really good. Um, just be grateful for everything, which I am very grateful. Thank you, God, for um, allowing me to have this, to have this opportunity to share with you guys and to basically buy all these products and you know keep me safe from all this. This is the hard drive. You know, to be honest with you, I didn't realize that it would be this big. I was trying to get the one at my job, the one like the one at my job, and that one was smaller than this. So this one, this is only doing some. This is a bad boy. This bad boy over here is gonna be doing some things. It's gonna be doing some things. It's gonna definitely help me. Oh. What is this right here? Well, this hard drive is definitely gonna help me 
um, mass produce and push out videos like crazy. So I cannot wait to upload more business videos, more vlog videos, more reaction videos that I'm doing later on today. Um, I definitely have been gone for two weeks and a couple of days when I'm recording it now. But um, I do like recording YouTube videos and letting you guys know a little bit more about me. Um, I know the first couple of videos I was kind of restricted because I don't want people to look at me like, oh, she's so weird. But this is just normally me you either love me hate me or whatever the case may be but i'm definitely gonna be me i'm gonna show my true authentic self and just get used to it and gary he's three years old now well he's turning three this december and i can't wait to celebrate his birthday and just celebrate his life um when gary came into my life he came into my life when i really needed somebody and he just basically gave me hope and i love him for that and i love my gary so he loves boxes so he loves jumping in boxes, scratching on boxes, biting boxes, rubbing his face on boxes. So this is just like, when are you going to leave? When are you going to move? So I can do it myself. Uh, um, I got olive oil for my lip glosses. I'm definitely going to put olive oil in some of my products, but some of them I'm not. But it's definitely good to have olive oil on hand. Like I have olive oil in my house, but I definitely want to keep it like separated. Um, if you are going to have like a cosmetics line or a beauty line, all of your products need to be you need to buy products for your house and then buy products for your line so this should not be touched for anything else i bought this this is marigold candela candela to me it just seems like sunflower sunflower rose petals that are crushed up but i guess it's candelilla so this is good i'm thinking about putting this maybe in a lip gloss or i don't know but it's also good to have just experiment um crumple paper I got black crumple paper, which I love. I'm trying, trying to go in the black theme, but I would love to have, like, get some, like, shiny red crinkle paper that I could use. This is so nice. Oh my god, I can't wait. I got some tape shipping tape. Yes, this is a must. This is more boxies. More boxes. Okay. So we got some pipettes. Um, yes, when you're doing your lip gloss, you need pipettes, so this is definitely good. I got some unrefined shea butter, and this actually feels so good. I definitely love this side, though. I'm curious. I'm not always You're so inquisitive. Oh, yeah. This looks, looks good. I've never had or held uh, shea butter, like raw and the front shea butter in my hands. This feels, this feels amazing. Ugh, okay, my body. So, um, meadow foam seed oil. I, uh, yeah, I just basically been doing my research and I see some people having this. And then, of course, you know, Miss Kylie Jenner uses these in her lip scrubs. So, we're going to see what we can do and we can incorporate this. This sounds really good. So, we're going to try. Um, sesame seed oil. I don't really know. What I'm going to use is sesame seed oil for, but we're going to try. Like we're doing experiments upon experiments upon experiments. We'll try. And then this is the, uh, germanium, Ger germanium, germanium, <laughs> rose oil. Listen, I'm going to put it in the description. You're going to see. <laughs> I don't know, girl. I don't know. You can't be asking these questions. Okay. If you've never held or used any of this stuff, you're, you're, you're bound to not know the name at all. I have never, never, like growing up, never. Never used any of those. I mean, sesame oil, yes, but none of these. So, tea tree oil, which I love. I thought I was supposed to get a dropper with this. Definitely need a dropper. I think I would use a pipette. Avocado oil. <laughs> coconut, liquid coconut oil. This is so good. I love how like, it's so light, but it has like a little like dillard to it. I think it's maybe my lighting, but definitely like that. I have apricot oil. So, some people don't use apricot oil, but I've heard good things about it, and it's really good for like smoothing fine lines and moisturizing your face, your hair, your body, everything. So, I think this is definitely a must. For certain things, I'm definitely gonna try to put these in my lip glosses and my lip scrubs. Um, grapeseed oil, this is definitely gonna be good for my skin. Um, yeah. I got more avocado oil. I think I got like a, a triple pack of avocado oil. And then I have castor oil. Um, and they gave me some like stuff for like 5 10% off feedback. CBD oil, listen, I don't think I'm in California. I can't get that, but I would love some CBD oil. Please, please. That's some. Okay. I got some organ oil, organ oil, organ oil. Of course, everything that I picked up is cruelty free, vegan free. So, organ, 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 organ. Yeah, the little kitty is like running around the place, so don't, don't worry about him. Yes, my little kitty, his name is Oliver. Um, I was coming home from work one day and he was just crying in the bushes. And then when I saw him, I, my heart melted because he was about, I think he was like three, two to three weeks old, maybe four, I could be wrong, but he's still small and so young. And he has teeth already. And when I first got him, I was bottle feeding him. Um, but now he's like eating all of Gary's food, liquid food, hard food, everything. So he's really good, but he has an attitude on him. I was just like, oh, <laughs> So I love him regardless. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna keep him. But listen, I don't know. I, it, getting Oliver was so unexpected, but I love him regardless. And um, I'm definitely 
thinking about moving whether it's to get my own place so Gary and Oliver can have like their own room or have a room together or like going to move in with my friends like, me and my friends are taking, thinking about going to California moving to LA or just like renting a house here in Houston so that should be something that we can talk about later but like that's not for sure um I've never really had any good relationships um past relationships with like roommates I tried to have one roommate with that was my best friend of like freaking eight to nine years and it just ended so badly and we don't even talk and I'm just like damn I lost an eight-year friendship because of that but was that friendship really real though I don't know I think I have a rose ship oil rose ship oil I don't know if you guys can see it so I'm going to see it or not I'm just going to list everything down below but it's rose ship oil I love the packaging that they have this in it's really cute and they have the droppers and definitely it's protecting everything I love how they did it went out of their way to do these like packaging you do the packaging right but like who else get frustrating if something's packaged too tight like um this is uh jasmine fragrance oil this oh i got two did i order two mm, okay that is there i have some almond oil this is definitely a must a must um what else is this you'll see buy the product and you'll see what it's like okay um the website is not available now i mean when i'm recording this you guys are probably going to see this way earlier before i do like the final actual launch um uh, i'm planning on launching i'm planning on launching um either july like either mid-july if not the end of july but definitely if it doesn't get to launch in july i'm definitely going to do something in august the first or second week of august like i just want to make sure so i get all the equipment in i'm doing this inventory huge haul now like i have another haul coming in because i still have to get stuff from tkd trading making cosmetics uh, com. i still have to get all the lipstick tubes all the lip gloss tubes from freaking china so we're waiting and then of course the eyeshadow palettes so we're waiting on that up uh, we got some real aloe vera juice some weed confetti weed confetti you know how i feel like this. we're about to yeah I, I mean like some people do a theme like once a year on 420 but i'm just like this is gonna be a permanent thing on my life like like, <laughs> like i'm not gonna lie like i haven't smoked weed in years but like <sighs> i mean like these are just gonna be like i'm gonna try to put something in there to just relax you like anytime you put these on the lips or whatever it just relaxes you but should i put these in the lip glosses i don't know we have to see i don't know we'll see it's probably something fun um i got more coffee I didn't order two bottles of coconut oil. I guess thank you for the free stuff. More coconut oil, um, grapeseed oil. <laughs> just like thank you so much for the free stuff. What is this? Ooh, I can't tell you about this one either. But this one, I can only say it's. I can only say that this one is like it protects your skin from harsh like environments. So you know how like you go out into outside and you automatically have a lip gloss. It like absorbs like dirt and all that this protects you from any like bacteria or anything. It's not a preservative, but it's something that protects you from getting like dirt melt in like i hate oh my god so i don't know maybe i can't i, I don't i just want to have like some secret ingredients you know because you know people watch our videos and they want to see what you're doing and it's always good to help people out you can tell them like most of the stuff you use but you can't tell them all the stuff that you use you want to try to keep that to yourself um carrot seed oil i'm just gonna mess around with this and see what we can do with this um i got bubble wrap everybody needs some bubble wrap bubble butt And these were pretty cheap. So my glass Pyrex bowls. It came into it came in three different sizes. So I'm definitely gonna. These cannot go in my kitchen. These are specifically for makeup. So. Uh, oh, oh. I thought it was about to fall on me. I was like, no. Yep, got it. Okay. So these to be honest with you, these are some. <sighs> these are some jars, some plastic jars. Honestly, I was hoping. I, I guess I wasn't looking at the sizes. I was trying to buy something like, like half the size, half the size. I didn't expect it to be this huge or big, but I'm definitely gonna put my lip gloss bases and my lipstick bases in these. So you could just have them on hand. Like some people keep in like containers or anything like that. I would say to invest in these so that way you can make big bolts. And if you're ready to use it, you can take a syringe or whatever and like suck it up or take a spoon and scoop it out. And that way it will just cut time, processing time, in my opinion. Again, all this box stuff is like sticking to my dress. Stop. I'm like a little kid in a candy store. 
Okay, so these are my um, holographic bags that I'm just going to put my... I think I got more. I got more of these holographic bags. I'm going to put my lip scrubs in them. I just want to have like a good packaging. Like I don't honestly to get design boxes for your like lipstick, lip glosses, anything. They're kind of expensive, but these holographic bags are so cute, right? So I can just put my lip scrubs in it, and I'll be so mad that I spent money on this. They can't go in a hole. That's what she said. Go in a hole, please. Please go in a hole. Guys, guys, bitch. Wait, I don't like how it's like. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe if I push it down a little bit. Maybe. Yeah, I mean, I want. I, I guess. These are okay. I'm definitely. Listen, I'll spend money on this. This is gonna be used. This is gonna be used to the fullest. Whether you like it or not, I don't care if it's like bended. Let's see if it can close. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. Tell me what you guys think about this, because. I just don't like the things on the side how it's like closing in that much but like tell me what you guys dinky yeah but we still don't use this we're not we don't waste money on hill. no ma'am oh also i got i really needed these i need batteries okay so i got two more batteries two more batteries for my cannon and i need battery because the battery life on this cannon is not it's not all that stretched out to be and i need this to be do better I need to do better. So. And plus, if I record long videos for you guys, I definitely want it to be like, guys, guys, guys. So, two extra new batteries that are chargeable. Thank you, Jesus. So I can just pop these out. Pop these holes out for you guys. I'm going to be back on my YouTube shit. So, I'm just going to be flying out with these guys. Flying out. I promise you. Love you guys. Okay. And also, if y'all watch my video and y'all have not subscribed yet, you won't even know yet. Are we even friends? I thought we were cool. I'm over here sharing my life, but you and you over here not even subscribe. Don't even hit the like button. I'm just playing. I see you. Sorry, not sorry. Um, I got these spatulas. It's got these uh silicone spatulas. Yes, these were so nice. So nice. I'm trying to smell what it smells like. <laughs> like these are so nice. So yeah, these are good. I can't wait to use it. I can't wait to start like today. Like today, today, today. I'm getting started on my face oil because I'm just like I'm ready to go. I'm ready to get moving. Okay, ready to get moving. Um. I got some rose, rose, rosebuds and rose petals. Um, I mean, I read some comments about these. People were talking about like how it had like a leaves in it, but this looks kind of good. It looks good, so hmm, thank you. It's about fifty cups, and it's from Bulgaria. Looks nice. Hmm, looks nice. So we're gonna try on that. We have some beeswax. I'm the beeswax. I'm the beeswax. So white beeswax, and it's actually. Right. Because I've, I've heard some reviews. Listen, you know when you're on Amazon, you read before you purchase, you read the reviews. And some of these reviews are horrible. I'm just like, I don't want to put my money on the line. They said it's white. Looking at it, it's white. It's white. It's white. Like it's like not like white white, but it has like a like a touch of yellow to it. But it's white white. It has a weird smell. Like it's not like a bad smell. It just smells like honey. Yeah, it smells like honey. Yeah. Okay. Um, sodium benzate. Uh, do your research, you'll find about this, but I can't really describe what it is to you. Uh, it's just like a preservative. So, yeah, we need a preservative for our lip glosses, our lipsticks. Preservatives are good. This is another thing that I'm not going to show you guys. Uh, but it'll, this is another thing that I'm not going to show you guys. Um, sorry. I'm sorry. There's certain things you just do. It, just please, guys, please, 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 please. I promise you, like, there's certain things that you can put in your formulas to make it creamy, to make it um, last long, long lasting, just shiny, just like. Just do your research, do your research, and tr use makingcosmetics.com. Just use it, I promise you. And they give you, um, like, they have recipes, tell you ingredients you need that are cheaper, that's cheaper than TKB training, and they explain to you about everything. Just try to use it. Like, I'm just, I'm new starting TKB training, I'm new buying from TKB training, but with them out of stock and out of style, like, you, we, we have to find our niches somewhere. So, we gotta find stuff somewhere. Can't go it off, but like the, the stain glue. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank my. Anyways, more butterfly, more glitter, more stuff. Yeah, I got some mica. Some mica and everything. I don't really want to take it out. I was playing with it last night. One of them are leaking, so I don't really want to take it out on my dress. That's black. So yeah, mica. You need mica. Oh, these are like the same boxes that I have. Oh my god, it is from Amazon. Oh wow. 
I, I didn't know you could ship in these. It's really bulky. I think they just drop shipped it because they put it in another box of, you know, all boxes need to go over here. Oh, oh, okay. Okay, okay. Make it fast. Okay. I got more glitter. More glitter. More stuff. Oh, tissue paper. So I got black and green tissue paper. I think my first my first palette is gonna be I don't know, I can't tell you, but it has to do with black and green. But I might change up no, yeah, yeah. It depends. I'm still making up my mind about this. Um, lip gloss tubes. I got the 15 milliliter lip gloss tube. I don't complain with it last night. So you need your lip gloss tubes. Um, these are going to be sold. These are going to be sold as like two. It's not going to be sold as one because I'm going to have something extra with, that comes with this. So it's going to be sold as a bundle, two together. And then I'm going to actually have a another lip gloss tube, a big lip gloss tube that people can buy separate. But these are going to come with something extra and y'all are going to be so surprised with that. I bought some more spoon tubes. I bought a uh, bigger syringe tube. These are like 100, 150 milliliters. So if you're ever doing wholesale, yes, these are huge. <laughs> so, oh, I guess they're gonna last for a lot of stuff. We gonna make it last. We gonna make it last. Oh wait, I got another like essential oil. Um, this one is clove leaf. Can you? You wrap the shit up so much it can't even breathe. Um, yeah, I got some clove leaf. Clove leaf essential oil. Um, I don't know what I'm gonna put it in yet, but I did do research on this. So, I have this big box over here, but I kind of know what it is and I kind of don't know what it is. Um, last piece of um, we got a measuring scale. So I actually got two measuring scales. The other one I don't think it's been shipped yet or it's gonna be shipped soon. I realized that I got a shipping scale and I didn't get a scale that I can measure in grams. So I think this one, yeah. This one, yeah, this one measures in grams and everything. So it's gonna be really good. I really needed this. So I have one to measure my like liquids, my solids, my everything. And then I have another one just specifically for shipping. I know it. I don't know. I don't know why I bought two, but uh, the first one, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Nice. Well, thank you for supporting. Yes, thank you for having this. Cute. Like, even like little notes like this, just like, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. I didn't know I had so much. <laughs> oh my god, I can see it up. Yes. Oh, okay. So, these were the lipstick tubes that I got initially. I love these. I love the square. I love like the whole granite feel, the square feel. Like it's just so, it's so good. I like it. I love it. You know, I love the design. The one thing that I don't love, I don't like the fact that it's not shiny. Like the bottom is shiny, um, but like everything else is not shiny. And it just feels like fake plastic. And I want to give, if I'm going to sell something to somebody, I want it to be of high quality. And I just don't think these are like of high quality. Not, I don't know. I'm kind of on the fence with this, so I haven't fully bought like the whole bulk of lipstick tubes yet because I want to do samples. I want to make sure before I spend, I fork out hundreds of dollars that I'm getting something that I'm completely in love with. And I think maybe I just have to sleep on this for a couple of days, maybe, but um, mm, I don't know. I just don't like it. It just, it don't feel like I have my first liquid lipstick I've ever bought was Dose of Colors. And if I compare the Dose of Colors to this, like the Dose of Colors is thick, it's heavy. And this is just, I don't know if it's because it's empty, but it just, I want it to be more, you know? This box is huge, huge, huge. Okay. So it's a portable photo studio. Okay. That's what it says on it. I think Amazon made a mistake because I think I have, I think I have another one on the way. And I think Amazon sent it to me twice. So I'm going to try to see if I can like be a good Samaritan and return it. If not, yeah, definitely return. I mean, I guess it's, I don't have to pay to return. I don't know. I don't know. But um, if I can't return it or anything like that, because it's so hard to get in touch with like Amazon customer service right now, I'm probably just going to do a giveaway. 
if I if I had to pay for it twice, then yeah, definitely give it back. If not, I'm just gonna do like do a giveaway or something like that. Tell me below, guys, what do you think I should do? Should I do a giveaway? Should I send it back? Let me know. Yeah, like no, the second one just arrived yesterday. Oh my god. Obviously, I don't have stuff delivered to my actual house. I have stuff delivered to another place. But. I can take pictures of my inventory and stuff like that. Well, like, yeah. Have enough. Go outside or anything. I mean, I have this professional looking camera, so I should be able to take pictures and there's Photoshop and there's everything. So, we're gonna get into it. But Okay, guys. So, I got scissors. I got a printer that I really needed. I got this desktop monitor. And then I got this organizer right here don't mind that in the background i'm painting my fireplace but basically i got this desktop monitor and then i got this uh organizer for my stuff i don't think all the stuff is gonna be able to fit into there so we'll see and of course my carrier this is gary don't mind the mess and then this is oliver please tell me why is this cat sleeping in this corner he's so cute but i don't know <sighs> yeah thank you guys so much for watching and commenting liking subscribing okay just make sure to join this family i love to hear from you guys to see you guys comment below ask me anything i am here i am going to be making more videos for you guys and we're just going to get into this okay but thank you so much and have a good one bye my mistakes i make regrets i get a hell while you break your neck i get a piece of mind when i squeeze the line mom ready to come with your sober up